Yo, what's going on everybody? Welcome yourself back to another episode of my Super Paper Mario series. Last episode, people, we went through this weird-ass place here, and it was actually kind of cool, I'll admit. It was probably the coolest place we've been through so far, but last episode, we're, there was this door here that we got the key for that I, I don't know what's going to lead to, but judging by the fact that it's a save, uh, save block, not safe block, and a locked door, it's probably going to be important, so... Let's get right into it, people. I'm still sick, by the way, as you can probably tell by my voice. I don't know. I don't know. Slowpokes! Squackles! Squirps was tired of waiting. Squirps almost gave up. How the fuck did he get all the way here? Anyway, the pure heart you're looking for is just ahead, Space Grunts. Squirps, you've done well. You're a smart... Wait, 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 wait. Squirple Squee! Stop it! Squirps is embarrassed! What? What? Wait, whose voice was that, Squo? Oh boy! <laughs> I wonder who it could be! Who, who are you? Oh, me? I'm just one, <laughs> just one of Count Black's more promising minions. The Green Thunder! Mr. L! Mr. L? Oh no! Squirps, no! I don't need you to tell me it's a cool name. I know it. Don't bother memorizing it. Why? Because I'm about to give you a burial at, a burial at, burial at sea. I mean, a burial in space. Just because you're in the red doesn't mean you're strong. Oh, uh, uh, have at you. Oh no. Oh, here we go. Oh no, whatever shall we- Oh shit, that was- uh, that actually kinda hurt. Oh shit. That's it. That's it. I'm f I'm fucking tired of your. I'm tired. I'm tired of your shit. I'm tired of your shit. Fucking take that. <laughs> oh god. Let's be careful. Hello. Oh no. How the fuck can he stomp on me, man? <laughs> yeah, just. Oh shit. He has an item. No. Stop you. No. Ah! Nope. <laughs> He's all what? Okay, that was easy. Oof, impressive! I guess there's but one thing to do, hmm? Come at me, Metal Bro! What? May I just mention, Mr. L's theme is probably my favorite theme in the whole game. It's just so good, I fucking love it. Anyway, haha, do you like him? This is my dear Metal Brother, he and I share a spiritual bond, you know. Yes, yes, and his name is Brobot! Oh no. Now things are gonna get annoying. Enough playing around, now for pain! Oh no. Oh shit. We're in space now! The gravitational laws of space allow Brobot's potential to be fully realized. Hey, Mr. Get foiled all the time by the guy with the red sta- with the guy with the mustache. I'll foil your face! <laughs> what is this writing? Alright, I'm gonna switch over to Mario. And right off the bat, I'm gonna wanna go for a fucking... We'll go for a long... Long last shake, because I want to make sure this ends up successful, you know? Because I don't want to fuck this up. We need to make sure we don't, like, die, you know? And luckily, I have carry as well, so it'll be a lot easier to move! Oh, Jesus fucking Christ. Basically, you just gotta fucking spam at him. Hello! Oh, speed up! Oh, no! Oh, God. That's not what I wanted. Shit. Hey, can you not do that? Oh no, I wanted that power up, whatever. Okay, cool. Oh shit. He got awfully close there, I'll admit. Hey, 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 hey. Fuck off. Let me get this. Barrier. Hey, oh, that's useful. Let's just fucking keep spamming at him. How much health does he fucking have? Holy shit. Hey, oh, power up. Oh snap. Holy shit. Now we're firing like missiles every once in a while. We are overpowered as shit. Oh, snap. Let me get that. Split. Oh, man. <laughs> Holy fuck. Uh, I don't think there was going to be any way he was going to survive more than two seconds. Anyway. Hey, this makes no sense. No, no. You beat Robot? Ugh. I'll let you off the hook for the rest of today, I suppose. But remember this. When fortunes smile next, she'll smile right here on Mr. L. I, I don't know what the fuck you're talking about, but okay. Uh, that was awful, Squirp. We have to pull ourselves together, Space Grunts. The pure heart is ahead. Come on, Squinkles. 
All right, man. All right. I love how we're still healing up and everything. Oh shit! Mommy, mommy, mommy! Scorps brought them here! What? We need to- What? Oh, we're finally here! Come on, say hi to Scorps' mommy, Squirp! What? Yep, this is Scorps' mommy, the queen of Scorpia? Her name is Scorpina- The 14th, I almost- I was like, the fuck is that number? This queen is your mother? So you are... Scorps is the prince of Scorpia, a once great kingdom. My true name is... Scorp Corgoline Scorpina. What? Okay. Nice name, but sorry for not telling you. Scorps promised not to tell. It makes Scorps a target. Long ago, Scorps' mother was told that destruction would come to the world. And in order to protect us from this, this destruction, we needed the pure heart. So mommy hid the pure heart in the woe zone, where no one could get to it. And so, 1500 years ago, Squirps was put into sleep, or was put to sleep in a hibernation capsule. Squeep! Squirps was meant to bring the hero here to protect the world, Squirple. Ah, so that's why. The Prince of Scorpia, Squirps, has a message, to deli uh, a message from the Queen to deliver. I bestow upon you the pure heart and hope that you will save the world. Here, take it, Squirp. Well, that was a little straightforward. I kind of half expected something hor something to go horribly wrong, but hey, luckily that's not the case. Hey, oh, you got a pure heart! Hey, <laughs> finally, that one took a bit. It was like I said, this chapter is not one of my favorites. If I'm perfectly honest, matter of fact, I'd say it's probably my least, but. Regardless, we're through with it now, so whatever. Anyway, phew! Now that Squirps is all relaxed, Squirps feels kinda tired, said Squirps. And with that, Squirps lay down before the statue of his beloved mother. Mother, he said, his voice soft. I did my best, right? Are you proud of me? Then slowly, young Squirps closed his eyes. The mission had weighed heavy on his tiny back, and he was proud to fulfill it. Well then, that was a nice little happy ending. Yeah, so guys, huddle up, Kate. We're gonna have a quick new minion orientation. His name is Mr. L, and he comes to us from one of our key competitors. Hmm, can't say I'm impressed by the minion quality. No, indeed, no wonder you've been trounced up to now. You're like junior up to now. You're like junior minions. Junior, come here, and I'll introduce you to Fist Junior and his wee pal Slappy. <laughs> Gosh, Mr. L, but didn't you get pretty spanked too? Maybe you're the junior. Spanked, you say? Ho-ho, I was scouting him, dear. He will be mine next time. Oh, boy. Yes, he shall know the fury of the one and only Mr. L, a.k.a. the Green Thunder. But enough about me. I need to head to the repair bay for bro robot modifications. L later Or, later Oh, I get it now. It's fucking whatever. Anyway. Though the man in red shall wield formidable powers, one shall stand against him. The man in green shall use the Chaos Heart's power to bring darkness to all. <laughs> so it is written in the Dark Prognosticus. So what you're saying is the man in green is our minion in training Mr. L? Well, that makes as much sense as a, <laughs> as a beef, and, beef and broccoli sandwich. Even though that makes a pretty decent amount of sense. Anyway, calm yourself, old chunks. Make ready. Count Black is sending you on a new mission. Ah, now that makes more sense. It'll be my honor, cunt. I, I cunt, yeah, cunt, <laughs> cunt blick. <laughs> that wasn't even intentional. I, Uchuk, swear to you, this year's got a hot date with me feet chunks away. You really could have phrased it in, like, any other way, but okay. My, aren't we hot-blooded? Well, well, I suppose that's to be admired. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'll be on my way as well. Ciao. So poor little Mimi doesn't get in, doesn't get to be in on the fun. This stinks. Shut the fuck up, Mimi. No one likes you. <laughs> yeah, I hate to seem like a whistleblower here, but oh, chunks may not actually even Dementio, Mimi, and Mister O may not be up to this. The hero's gonna collect the beer hearts and come here. He'll come for you. <laughs> All is according to plan. Count Black assures you. 
It's strange. Nobody ever, um, cherished the universe the way you once did. And yet you've been made to destroy it. That's quite enough, Anastasia. You'd what? If only I could, you know, been that girl, things would have been different. She cannot be replaced. You can never hope to do so, Anastasia. Yeah, um, I'm very sorry, that just slipped out. Oh, that's, uh, things are getting awkward here. To be sure, she is gone. Gone from all worlds, never to return. Shit's awkward now, oh boy. Man, I feel bad for Anastasia. Because <laughs> I know exactly what they're talking about as well. What, what are you thinking? There's no possible way. No one would allow it. If we can't be happy here, we must leave for a place that will accept our love. But, Blumier, is there such a place? Think. I can't bear to see you hurt again. If our love has no home, let us spend our lives searching together. So I beg of you again. Tiffany, marry me. I promise I will make you happy. You you just won't give up, will you? Of all the crazy, stubborn, foolish men. Tiffany, answer me, please. Blumier, I love you. Take me away. Take me to a world where we can be happy. That is some nice, wholesome shit right there. But it still probably doesn't make sense to a lot of people watching. It's... I, I feel like they've at least dropped enough hints for it to be kind of obvious, but... If not, you'll figure it out soon enough, maybe? Possibly? I don't know, whatever. Anyway, now we've collected... or now we've gotten five pure hearts. This is turning into quite a collection. <laughs> what I tell you, huh? You've got the king of all evilness on your side. You can't go wrong. Yes, yes. I'm not fucking teeing gods. Who the fuck does Tippy think she is? Anyway, that said, we owe Squirps for helping us on this one. We should be grateful. Even though you were complaining about him, but whatever. Say, Tippy, something seems different about you recently. You seem a little bit more cheerful. It's a nice change. You think so? Well, ever since you saved me from Fort Francis, I've been feeling really good. I feel like I could just hang around Mario with- or uh, hang around with Mario forever. Oh, no. So you're all back? No. We're all fucking dead, Merlin. What does it look like? How was it this time, then? Did you find another pure heart in outer space? Yes, we found the fifth pure heart. And this one- oh, whoa, 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 oh god, what? Uh, excuse me? <laughs> what? Tippy! Uh, excuse me? What has happened? All of you, come to my house at once. Hurry now! What the fuck? Um, okay, that happened. Very well, let's all take a breath. And gather ourselves here. I'm concerned. Tippy may be unable to maintain her pixel form for much longer. Her pixel form? What the heck does that mean? Well, you see, Tippy was not always a pixel. I found her in her true form, exhausted. Cursed to wander through dimensions forever. She was hanging by a thread, barely alive, so I took a desperate measure. Using my ancestor's magic, I transformed her soul into a pixel, and this Tippy was reborn. I can hardly believe it. So, where is Tippy from originally, then? She had lost her memory, so I have had, so I have no idea who she is or where she's from. But I can't help but think she did not come here by chance. Fate connects us. And my intuition in this area is rarely mistaken. Oh no. Fucking Bowser. <laughs> the void has grown larger. And these tremors have become common, I'm afraid. Our situation grows more dire by the moment. Will the events written in the like prognosticus really forestall the foretold doom? I will watch over Tippy. Young heroes, take the pure heart. Find the next heart pillar. Yeah. Alright, now I have a pretty decent idea as to where the next heart pillar could be, but I'm not completely sure, you know? So I'm gonna check the fortune teller. I'm gonna... Merlovely, I think? I always forget her name. And it's stupid of me, because it's like, she's my favorite of the fucking Merleys, the fucking Mer whatevers. Did she, uh, 45! What? It, it costs a whole bunch less before, but okay, whatever. It's, it's worth it. Ah! Focus, focus, focus! Kadabra! <laughs> Cabra. Cabra de Abra. Hullabaloo! <laughs> Paka, Puka, Peekaboo! Ah! Ah ha ha! 
Oh, stars that fill the bright, the vast night sky. See this soul who's lost the way. Show me. You just sound like you're a fucking crazy person. I see your destined path. You seek the other side of flip side. You reach the back. Yep. Okay. Hit the switches correctly and so. Okay. Okay. I had a. I just wanted to make sure. You know. Yeah. Sure. You can never be too sure with this game. There's always a million things you can do in this game, so it's like, I just wanted to be 100% sure I was going in the right- or going to the right place before anything else. Now, sadly, we won't be playing a minigame today. But, probably, like, next in-betweener, I'll make sure I get, um, some minigames in there, you know? Because let me tell you, th those minigames are fun as fuck. Maybe not as fun as the one that I played, but they're still they're still fun, okay? Whatever. So let's get to where we need to go. It's not too far of a travel, luckily. It's just some- it's that- it's that little crack in, like, the back of the, um... Back of this floor right here that we're going to, that I mentioned that you might want to remember for a bit, because... It's important now, because if you remember what... What the fuck was there? Fleep can do again. Um, it is essentially, you, you need fleet for that, that's why you haven't been able to do anything with it up until now, you know? And now that we can actually use it, that's cool! So all we gotta do, switch over to fleet. And... BAM! Oh, no, 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 god damn it. And BAM! And we hit that, and... Oh no, what happened, right? Well... Shabam! You can see a little bit of this way back when, when I talked about it. But here, we can- we can finally go through here. And you're probably like, well, what's through here, right? Well... It's the mirror hall. Now, the one problem with this, I'll admit, is I have not a damn clue... Uh, how we activate this. So, you know what? I'm just gonna fucking search this shit up real quick. Oh god, I just remembered what this was like. Okay, hold up. I have an idea. Oh, damn it. I nearly had it. No. Fuck! D fucking d Ah! No! I have this whole side ready. Come on. No! No! Oh, okay, cool. Damn it! Hold up. Ho ho. Is, is that it? D oh, why? Okay, what if I... N no. Okay. What if... What? Damn it. No! This is bullshit. Alright, alright, you know what? How about... I exit and try this again. I don't remember this thing at all. We're gonna be here a little bit, okay? I need to... I'm doing this, alright? Alright, so what if I... Okay. And what if I... Hmm. If I do that... And then what if I... No, I'm so close! Fucking God! Damn it! Ah, I'm searching it up. Alright, I give up already. <laughs> it was literally as simple as just hitting them all once. Are you actually kidding me? I hate my life. Whatever. Now, we can flip on over to this side. And as you can tell, things are... You're probably a little confused. You're probably like, well, what's on this side then, right? Well... Prepare yourself. Things are gonna get weird. We're no longer in flip side, people. Now we're in flop side. And as you can tell... This place is clearly not the same, just from the music alone. Something's different here, is what I'm trying to get at. Alright, so we can go through there, but I also want to check out over here before anything else. Let's see. It's also weird, because it like, flips the opposite way as well, so that's gonna be very confusing. But whatever. Ahara, <laughs> not to brag, but I just so happen to be a best-selling novelist. Tell me, have you ever heard of The Grotus Chronicles? I created that epic cartoon. Mm, yes, and as of late, my mind positively brims with ideas of utmost quality. I've hit my um, all my deadlines for the next five years, so I can spend my time at leisure. 
Oh, cool. Good for you, man. I'm tempted to go in the card shop, but I know if I go there, we're not leaving for a couple minutes, so, uh... I'll save that for next time, maybe. Whatever. Okay. What's through here? We got a house. Cool, whatever. Cooking. Cool, whatever. Can't go through there. Cool, whatever. But... We can head up here, so I guess we just have to. It's just so weird, man. It's like, I'm not used to Flopside at all, because... It's- it's just like, it's been so long since I've been in Flopside because it's been so long since I've played the game and- Oh! I welcome you! I knew you would come by eventually. Oh ho, I can see that you would like to ask- or you would like to ask me where in the world we are. Oh ho ho ho, this place may seem like Flipside, but do not be mistaken. You were in Flopside, but now you flip flop sides. Friends, you are in Flopside! Which means I am not the Merlin you know. I'm the Flopside version, a different Merlin entirely. You may call me Nolrem. To be honest, it sounds cooler. Anyway, don't you see, ours has always been a story of two towns. But the only ones who know about this flip-floppery are Merlin and I. You seem a bit surprised. Ho 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 ho. There's a front and back to all things, young ones. Now the heart pillar is one floor up. Go place the pure heart within it. See you. Alright, man. Thank you for the help. That was... He was awfully friendly. And I'm a little surprised. But also, it's like, hmm, I'm, I'm suspicious as well. I, I don't know. Whatever. Now, there was some guy over here. Hello, friend! Ah, I'm surprised you are finding me. I am called Welderberg. I am the Iron Man of forging... I am the Iron Man of the forging of pipes. Have you ever thought, Ah, it is taking so long to get around town. Yeah, me too. And so it is my life's work to make the pipes for transportation. I have inspected here, yeah. I am thinking I can make the pipe leading to Flipside. What do you think of this? You are covering cost of materials and labor, yeah? I could make such a pipe. You are looking not very rich. How is about 300 coins? Are we having a deal? No way! You are not needing the pipe. Such sadness. If you are changing your mind, please return, yeah? Alright, man, I got you on that deal. But for now, I'd say we don't necessarily need it. Especially since we're more than likely going to be spending most of our time here in Flopside, seeing as we still need to do the whole heart pillar stuff and everything else, I suppose. Plus, it's not too far to travel, so it's whatever. Is the heart pillar right here? Okay, great. To be honest, the only annoying thing will be coming to Flopside, because we'll have to, you know, keep traveling back and forth and back and forth and back and forth, that sort of thing. But it won't be too bad to get to Flipside from Flopside, because we have that one pipe that takes us back here. There we go, though. You appear to be performing your duties efficiently. I just got a message from Merlin. Tippy's been revived! They are waiting for you at the top of Flipside Tower. Hurry, you must go there! You know, I want to, but I need to end off the episode. Hold up, I want to get back to, like, the save block before anything else. Seriously, though, to be honest, I do kind of enjoy Flopside more, because it just looks cooler, man. Like, it's just a lot more, like... I guess dark and run down, and I don't know, I just personally think it looks a lot better that way, but whatever though people, if you have enjoyed today's video, be sure to drop a like as well as a comment, be sure to subscribe if you really feel it, and I shall see you guys next time. See you!